All right, welcome back Facebook, uh, YouTube. This is uh, Brother Quinn, uh, Florida Street Preachers. We are unashamed tonight as we preach the gospel down here, one, uh, Romans 1.16. Preaching the gospel down here at uh, Siesta Key in Florida. So I'm going to turn the camera around now and then uh, Brother Daniel's going to preach. So God bless you all. All right. All right. Glory be to Jesus Christ. Glory be to the Father. Uh, Jesus Christ is the one who was born of the flesh according to the seed of David, but declared to be the Son of God by the resurrection from the dead. Jesus Christ is alive today, and He is the Word of God. The Bible says in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. Amen. You people come out and you celebrate Christmas. Most of you have no idea what you're even celebrating. But those of you that think that maybe you are celebrating the birth of Christ, that's what, that's what it's about. That the Son of God came incarnate, in skin, in flesh, to take upon the sins of the world upon himself. Because he knew that this world was wicked as he destroyed the world with a flood, knowing that the violence was on their thoughts always. So is this world that we live in today. There's perversions, there's lewdness, there's violence. There's, there's drunkenness and, and immorality constantly, constantly on the minds. You can talk to him. Constantly on the minds of people today in this country. Well, there you go. That's my evidence. You're confirming the Catholic Church. That's my evidence. You can know who Jesus is. Because if you had Jesus, you'd have the Spirit of God, and you would know that there's no reason for you to be confirmed in the Catholic Church. You would know that Jesus said, unless a man be born again, you guys are hypocrites. Unless a more man be born again, Jesus would not judge will not inherit this the kingdom man. of God. So you call me a hypocrite. Where's your evidence? Not this man, sir. Not, Where's your evidence? Not this man. Then no. You're human. Son of God. Well, people have got, the Bible says that God hates the false witness of the red lies. People come out and call hypocrites. The spiritual man judges no all things, but is rightly judged There's no evidence that I'm a hypocrite. You have no 15. evidence that I'm a hypocrite because I'm not a hypocrite. I put childish ways behind me. I've repented of all my known sin and walking away from sex before the Father. No. Maybe later. Right now I'm here. This is too important. People need to hear this. You want it You want it louder? No, no, no. No, 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 no. No, don't, don't, don't touch me, okay? I'm out here. I appreciate you asking me. I'm respectfully declining because all these people need to hear the message of salvation through Jesus Christ. This is this is a demonic uh, event of, of, of idolatry and, and devil worship. No, but there's more and more people coming. Okay, I appreciate your concern. I'm going to continue to preach. Well, it's not just it's disturbing because you're in sin and, you're, and you don't like you don't like the message. You don't like the word of God discerning the thoughts and intents of your heart. You don't like the the message of the Bible, the, 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 the double-edged sword. You don't like it because it's dis it's discerning the thoughts and intents of your heart. It's exposing you. It's exposing your sin. It's exposing your sin, people. I think that's louder than I'm being. It's gotta stop. It's gotta stop. It's gotta stop. Down a little bit. It's it's the one stop. word wisdom it's from you. Stop. It's stop. The Bible says that I deliver first of all unto you that which I also receive, that Christ died for our sins according to the scriptures. Christ died for the sins of mankind according to the scriptures. The Bible says that no prophecy of scripture comes from private interpretation, but that holy men of God spoke as the Spirit led them. He spoke as the Spirit led them. He is led by the Spirit of God. To, to record these things for you and for me so we could have them and know that it's the truth. The Bible says that the word of God is pure like silver, perched in the earth, tried seven times in the fire. No hands on to talk or anything. about how, how false the Bible is and how, and, how many, uh, and how many errors there are, but they can never find any. Is this the last time you're with your mother? No, 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 
someone's going to be here. The, bi the Bible, the Bible, she needs to know. If she, if she is one, that, if she is one to enjoy, if she enjoys this, if she enjoys this, and she's not a Christian, and she needs to know the truth. She needs to know the truth. That if you are not born again, you're not going to inherit the kingdom of God. It doesn't matter your good deeds. They don't outweigh your bad deeds. The Bible says if you keep God's law, in its entirety, yet break it in one area that you are guilty of wrong. I, I turned it down, buddy. I did turn it down. I did turn it down a little bit. What's not okay is you taking my personal information and leveraging it. That's I'm not leveraging anything. I'm just saying that if you're not born again, you're not going to inherit the kingdom of God. That's, that's the scripture. That's the truth. You need to be born again. That, the Bible says that which is born of the flesh is flesh, but that which is born of the spirit is spirit. Everyone's, everyone's had a, a, a flesh and birth. Born of water, right? You were born in your, you were, you were, you were um, born your mother's water, so you were born of water. Your mother brought you out. Don't touch, don't touch my equipment. You're on video, buddy. Okay, you're on video. That's not, that's not lawful. Okay, you're not allowed to touch and invade my personal space and touch my equipment. Okay? Okay. 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 The Bible says, and how can the young man cleanse his way by taking heed according to your word? It says, thy word, O Lord, have I hid in my heart that I might not sin again. That's what my Bible is. It's written in my heart. I study it. I memorize it. I meditate on it. I fast. I pray about it. And God gives me understanding. He gives me understanding of these things. That's all I know when the Bible says, you go out to the highways and the byways and the hedges to tell them to come here. That's why I know that you can come out here and read and read that you would come in. There is a, there is a Why do you believe in a million lies, but you don't believe in God? But, and you've been invited, Jesus Christ. He, the, the brother Quentin said before, I've lifted up, I'll draw all men onto myself. God calls all men everywhere to repent. So you've been, you've been, you've been called to repent. And I'm out here again calling you to repent, living your wicked lifestyle. Stop being a pervert. Stop being a pervert and put your faith in Jesus Christ. Paul said he wanted to testify to the Jews and the Greeks of repentance to God and faith in That's Jesus disgusting. Christ. That's disgusting. Come on, big guy. Thanks for coming. Too many people as they go to these churches, all they talk about is faith in Christ. It's all about faith in Christ, faith in Christ. But there's no talk of repentance. There's no talk of repentance of God. No hands on, sir. No hands don't on. I got, I got video camera, sir. Don't touch me. We don't want you to go to jail. Do not touch me. No, it goes Listen, both ways. Do not touch me. It goes both ways, sir. You touch him, you're going to jail. I, I, I didn't touch him. I got it all right. on video. Listen, I'm just saying just don't touch him. I did not touch him. I'm just saying just don't touch him. You, you're, you're free to do what you want. Hey, get this man. You're not, you're, you're just doing permanent damage to my ears. I don't touch me. Do not touch me. Don't think that's shut up. Same rules apply. No, I'm not putting, I'm, I'm standing here. I'm not on top of you guys. You guys have come out here. No, you guys come out here. You came to me. You came to me. I'm out here. I'm, I'm like, I'm like 30 or 40 yards away from you. Speak on the, the police are on their way now, okay, because you're unruly, you're unlawful, this is, this is unruly, rebellious behavior, okay, and, and we're going to endure it, we're going to endure it. Protected freedom of speech, sir, right. is constitutional right, you what you're doing is not your you see that? So that is discrimination, you don't care about our rights here, that is discrimination. you do not have the right to bang a cowbell two inches from somebody's ear, that is not a constitutionally protected okay, okay. right. Yes, I do. I, I came out here. I gave you space. We're not right on top of you. You guys are coming to us. You guys walked up to us. Okay? I know this message stirs you up. I know you're stirred up because you don't like the body. You hate God. You hate Jesus. But he's patient just like we're patient. He's desiring. He wills a number of parents. He doesn't want you to perish in hell. God does not take pleasure in the death of the wicked, but that you would turn and live. That's what God's desire is, that you would turn and live. Turn from this lifestyle of idolatry. These wicked, demonic... Drum circles, drum so folks, this is what we come up against every time we come down to the drum circle. So uh, these things are demonic, they're evil. Uh, this, Of course, the circle, they're invoking evil spirits. It's paganism, and uh, it's only fitting they do it on Christmas Eve. So uh, this is this is the time of their uh, solstice. So, so folks, uh, 
it's only going to get worse as the sun goes down. But we're here to proclaim the gospel. The righteous will stand bold as a lion. So uh, we're going to stand, and we're going we're not going to leave till uh, we feel it uh, that the Holy Spirit is leading us to do so. So just please uh, keep us in prayer, folks. No reveler, no sorcerer, will have any part, have any part in the kingdom of God. We're going to have no part in the kingdom of God. You know how God is going to be glorified by you, sir? I know exactly You know how he's going to be glorified by you? I know. By throwing your sorry conscience into hell. God's All right, I'm going to go ahead and end this live feed, folks. I'm going to turn the camera around sideways and get a live feed that way because I'll get a lot more video in of the folks around them. So tune in.